everyone and welcome, my name is Andrew Can, and together we can game. In the last episode of Can Play Far Cry 2, we made our way to that satellite where we got a mission to take out that moving target. You can see marked on red on our map. We're going to make our way to it, take it out, and I'm very curious to see what's in store here. If I was to take a guess, I would say that's probably pretty similar to other missions where it's just kill a target, get rewarded. However, before we move on, I did say I was going to check in our journal where we have terminate the target on the map, find someone who can provide medicine as our current target, and receive our mission details as we receive the cellular message to terminate a target. We have more information here, such as I got a nasty fever, so sickness level is one, reputation one. These guys look at me with no contempt. I like this. I like the amount of detail we are given. I also see, you know, there's the jackal tapes. You can also see what upgrades we have, which is very cool. And just very overall cool things to see. Now, vehicles are something I'm really interested to see what this means. I think maybe they'll go to our uh, our uh, safe houses, which would be very cool to do. We only have three jackal tapes. And our statistics. So I really like just our favorite primary weapon, our favorite secondary weapon. You can just see my shot accuracy see is abysmal wounds healed 55 diamonds found 130 current diamonds i really like that i think it's really cool that we get an in-depth look at the statistics here buddy missions complete four out of 12 main missions done wow we're only 20 percent in but we've done seven out of 32 missions it's not bad at all actually <laughs> pretty surprised really surprised we've done so much ooh, 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 ooh. I hear some firing. If I can, I do want to avoid that. Now I'm going to go off the beaten path a little bit here, or apparently a lot of it here. <laughs> and now there's an airfield, which looks to be pretty contested. But the red arrow is where I'm trying to be. No one cares about the green arrow, except maybe Stephen Amell, though that's a pretty stretch of a joke. I do like the show Arrow, though I'm not caught up. I stopped watching after season three. But that's neither here or there. Going back to Far Cry 2, I did ask people what your thoughts were between this game and the first Far Cry, and overall a general positive consensus is uh, drawn between these games. Uh, the idea that I had, or my thoughts of, it wasn't what I was expecting, but it's not a bad game, is pretty, pretty much echoed by the, my viewers, so appreciate that. Oh, God! Was not expecting that. <laughs> Whoops. We'll be right back there. All right, so we are back. I am going towards our target. I want to see if I can hit their convo. Uh oh. Here's you're not a part of their convoy. Where is the target? Question mark? Um, here's, this is it. What? I thought for sure that was it. Then, where did the jeep go? What? Am I missing it? Well, I do need to go this way. How did I... It's saying it's over there, but I don't see it. Okay, shoot. Well, didn't shoot where they were gonna be, so... Not well enough to get their attention. Which wasn't well at all. Hindsight. Hindsight, man, my accuracy rating is pretty fair. Alright, well, I'm very confused on this section. But, um, I guess what I'll do is go to where there's apparently more medicine and there's a diamond over here. I am, let me know if you know what happened. I think the, the jeep despawned. If I'm being honest. Got him! 
That was me shooting where it was going to be. Oh. Okay, now who's hitting me? Quick save. Oh, might as well drive out of this. Oh, the best of my ability, try to get back to the main road. I need to get more medicine. It looks like this is a way that will get me to more. So, ah, I'm very lost if I'm, oh man, I need to, yeah, running empty. Yeah, I need to get some fast. So maybe, I don't know, maybe this had some good, I'm very confused. But one thing I will say is, I think I'm handling vehicle sections in Far Cry 2 better than I did in Far Cry 1. I also like the fact that I can't go as fast because my vehicle is damaged, and that's it's an incentive to fix it to get it to go a little faster, and I like that. I approve of that. I think it's cool. Now one mechanic I don't like is whatever happened to that target. It's still on my map, but there's nothing there. Yeah, except it's still showing up as there's something there. Wow, okay. Okay. Also important. Oh. Also important I check out what's down here. Okay. And here we are. Woo! Much needed first aid. And some ammo? I will take that gladly. In fact, there are a lot of positives to taking that little detour. I do like that it does reward you for making choices like that. I think that's a cool little thing it can do. I mean, was it super useful? Eh, not really. But it's something. I'd rather be rewarded with a little health and some ammo than nothing. Else. So, I know I need to get medicine, but I don't necessarily know. The next time I'm gonna be this way, because this uh, safe house seems to be a little off the beaten path. So I don't mind taking the time and exploring. Also, it gives me time to reflect what happened. Because like I said, I asked if you knew what happened to please inform me, because I'm gonna be honest. That was confusing. You're dead. You're shot, at least dead, but now you're dead. Alright. You can now save my game here. And that is what makes it worth it. Saving the game, new ammo. Well, not new, but more. Okay. I should probably switch these out. This gives me... How many shots do I have with this? Can't seem to draw them here. Huh, never noticed that before. Well, one shot is better than no shot. So, continuing on the path here. Back to kind of where I was going, anyway. Still have a vehicle. I don't know if that water is deep enough for me to jump into it, but. Should be. Let's find out! <laughs> I like that. That was fun. Alright. So we got a safe house. We're getting some forward progress. We're really just getting some new landscape and scenery that I'm enjoying a lot. And there's our vehicle. Now then. Where's the medic? Well, not here. Where are you? Oh, that was a genuine miss. Alright. Well, they found mine, so there was my vehicle. They were scavengers. Oh, no, no, no! Well, I did a good job of messing that up. Luckily for me, I had my original vehicle I can go to. And looks like I'm gonna need, so... <laughs> Thankfully... I have two chances here. Weapon. Not a fan of this pistol. I need to upgrade. I need to get a more reliable pistol. 
and upgrade it so I can have a better sidearm. Because I do like my rifle. My rifle's come in handy and has saved my butt more than any other weapon I really have. Kind of my primary. And I do need to go ahead and get my AK-47 because, you know, Andrew can, AK, yeah, it works out well. Interesting enough, I can't... Well, we can see. I mean, usually, when you try to do something like this, it takes twice as long. Maybe not. Seems that basic jumping gets you pretty far, though. Quick save. Oh, B! We made it pretty ways away without having to really do much. Now, we have been here before, at least I believe so. Definitely remember the area. Another way of how we got here, though. It could still be safe, but I'm always on the side of caution. I try to be on the side of caution places. You never know. Just because you cleaned it once doesn't mean that it's fine. Yeah, the graves. See if this opens for me. Nah, it won't. Dune buggy. Alright, let's go back in. Get more medicine. Fred, you look so good. You're wasting your time, sir. We have nothing left. But there's a general store I know. A mile southwest of Powder. It's on your mind. Great, we're wasting our time now. See if you have anything else. He can help you. It's been too dangerous to deliver these travel papers. If you get these to him, he'll give you your medicine. Objective updated. Thanks. Listen to me. It's dangerous out there. Approach cautiously. Will do, friend. Will do. Well, now we have another mission. Right, let's go ahead and see where I need to go. At this point, it's quicker to take the bus station. So what I'm probably going to do, since I've already shown this, is we will meet back at the other bus station. Well, I was going to meet there, but then... Then this happened, and there's a diamond nearby, so... Of course, have to take out them. Then... Where's the diamond? Come on. There we are. Found a trail. Diamonds at this point are what's keeping me kind of exploring. And I do think showcasing where I find them is important. Because I always encourage my viewers to try to play along with me if you can. I know in open world games like this you can make your own decisions. I do highly recommend you get the game I play. Because I always think you should support the games in more way than one. If you enjoy the Let's Play, the best way to show your gratitude to a developer is purchasing their game. The best way you can show your support to any game developers to purchase their game. Now, I don't think you should just blindly purchase a game because you like the developer, but I do think if you've seen enough of the game to realize that, hey, I like this, you should consider buying it. Let me know your stances on it. How many Let's Plays have you watched, and have you ever purchased a game because you saw it in a Let's Play? I don't think anyone's ever purchased a game because they saw me play it, but I think that'd be cool to someday get there. Now, continuing, this seems like... Oh, oh man. Seems like it's just gonna be another area. You can die. I don't want to deal with you guys. Oh, but you don't give me chances. You make me have to. Yeah, don't even give me that chance, man. I wanted to do this pretty peacefully. But yeah, pull me back at the other station. Alright, and here we are, and I love that we get the ATV again. So, uh, alright, now to get to where we need to go on our map, we need to deliver these papers for the medicine. That's gonna be pretty crucial for what we want to do, which is survive and eventually confront the Jackal, which is our primary objective. So the side quest and helping our buddies do help us in the short term. Overall, getting them and helping 
is its own reward of sorts. Alright. Okay, gotta be careful with you. Really? You're gonna reload out in the open like that? You've just unlocked an underground location. Good, happy to hear that. Able to clear that out. See, basically in Far Cry 2, if it's a location you have to go, there will be enemies. But let's see what happens when we give this new person the papers. I saw what you did up there, thank you. And you brought travel papers. You can deliver them yourself. Come, come in. You have the fever, my daughter too. We will share our medicine. You have travel documents? Wow, so the underground is going to probably be the same kind of mission over and over, isn't it? New location, get new meds for trading information. Let's go ahead and trade it. You will be better now, we will be better. We help each other, yes? Mission completed. You will be better and we will be better. Quid pro quo. Alright. Oh. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Helped me continue my mission. And there is a diamond nearby, so win win. That one target. Oh. Hard to find at all. That one target's gonna be the bane of my existence. Go ahead and tell you that now. No. Weapons mission, not too far from here. I think that is a great thing to do. Especially considering I new weapon need new weapons, so we'll meet there. I'll say this for Far Cry 2, visually, I think it still holds up considering the game's age. And I also think the colors are just so vibrant and gorgeous. However, go ahead and get another weapons mission, see what we can upgrade and see what we can do. Before I do that, I do want to come in here. Ammo. Explosives. Go ahead and heal. Because I do know they usually have first aids in the shop itself, so I'm going to go in here, see the guy, see what he has to say. My friend, how about some side work today? Here's my problem. This Ukrainian is trying to move in on my business. He's got a shipment coming in. Bad product, none of it clean. You take out that convoy and I'll bring in some special inventory for you. Thank you. Are you sure you want to accept this will abort any current objective? I'm going to accept it. Let me know what the problem was with the other objective because that was really confusing. I love that enterprising spirit, my friend. All right, mission accepted, and let's go to the computer. Objective updated. I want to see what I can do this time around. Attacking from range can decide a battle before it begins. Use sniper rifles to wound and pick off stragglers, but remember to relocate frequently for a long range punch. Best in the mortar. Difficult to master, but shelling a camp from range is the best way to assault. So I can get the AK-47, I think. Oh, I already own it. Never mind. Hmm. Out of all of these, what I think would be the best... AD is pretty expensive, but, uh... I think a silent weapon would be good, but not necessarily for... Gonna go with the Star 45, the manuals, Homeland 37, accuracy, accuracy, and nothing on the accuracy of my new weapons, but that might be locked with time. Ammo upgrade, Grenadier. Can't afford this, medium card. Kit Serret update upgrades, those are what I want to save for. Those will be worth it. Um, in the meantime, I'll get more grenades. Go ahead and check out. I'm pretty okay with this. New weapons, new things, new upgrades unlocked. Go to the safe house, get. Let's see what all I can do. Because I did do a lot. I do like upgrading the weapons, and as I mentioned, that's a cool facet for me. There's the AK-47. But it takes away my rifle. I do enjoy the rifle. Shotgun. Okay. There's a new pistol. The only thing I'm not really seeing, right? 
Oh, right there. Okay, it makes sense. Alright, let's go take out the new person. New target. We'll meet there. Oh, he's not too far away, actually. You know what? I don't mind driving this one, getting a little opportunity. But as I said, we have been informed that every weapons upgrade mission is going to be the same. Take out this person coming on my territory. So, now we at least know that. So, I'm not necessarily too upset about doing the same missions like this every time. I know it's padding, but arguably anything you do in game pads the game time. But let me know your thoughts on video game padding. Do you think this is alright padding or do you have an issue with it? I don't necessarily know, know what really good padding is and I think it would be a good discussion to have. So let me know your thoughts on it. So continuing this way, I'm going to go ahead and eliminate my target. Who knows, maybe I'll get another call and I can eliminate the other target. Usually someone in a vehicle. Of course. There we are. And now that that happened, I need to repair this so I can find the rest of that convoy. Okay. Getting pretty fastly repaired. I usually wait for it to stop because that's full repair, at least I believe. Time to follow suit again. Alright. I didn't mean hit, mean to press E there. <laughs> but I do kind of enjoy the chasing them down and hunting them aspect. I think it's pretty fun and I think it adds a good challenge. Though when we pick up random stragglers like this, I don't like it. You're a waste of my time. Really? Just gonna take over? Ah, there it is. Came back. Surprising. Come on. Man, I am missing. I've been following my own advice. Shooting where they're gonna be. Uh, seems to circle around is the only kind of saving grace here. Why did it circle, actually? It makes no sense to me. Maybe it's just trying to help me out. I should have practiced what I preached there. Okay. Also, go ahead and it'll come back. If not, well, I'm going for it, so. I do love watching the sun, though, and overall, getting more opportunity to drive and just experience this world is exciting for me. I don't know if it's exciting for you, but I hope it is. I wonder if we'll just watch them kind of circle around. They really don't have a rhyme or reason. It doesn't appear. Oh, well, that has a rhyme or reason. Yeah, I can do that, but when it comes to the one that matters, terrible. Oh, never mind. I'm pretty good. <laughs> I like how when I'm trying from not too far a distance, I can't seem to get it. When it's a much larger distance, another story. Well, that should do what I want that to do. Can't tell if that hits the vehicle or what. That's all I needed to do. I go ahead and, uh, where's my, oh, no, darn it, I'm going to lose it, yeah, well, at least I completed the mission, right, okay, so, there's one last thing I want to do before we go, now, the wise viewers and the 
ones who know me for a while will figure it out. We'll meet back there. And if you guessed I'd be infiltrating that safe house, you were right. You know me pretty well. So I want to go ahead and get this out of the way while I can. Not necessarily sure what I'm going for here. It doesn't seem like this is much of a safe house. Oh, but there it is. All the same. Eh. Really, the safe house isn't secure. That means there's still someone here. Higher ground isn't always the best ground. Especially when you don't know where they're shooting. Uh oh. Right there. <laughs> Sweet. Safe house unlocked. You can now save your game at the safe house, which I think is a good idea. You know what? That's going to be it for this episode. That's going to be it for today. Let me know. What do you think about the mission that just didn't seem to work? I saw it at first, but then when I got hit by that car, it wouldn't... I guess maybe it despawned because of that? I, I'm trying to figure that out. Also, let me know if you've ever purchased a game from watching a Let's Play. And I'm very curious to if you have. Also, let me know, do you think there's such thing as good padding? I'm curious to what you have to say. But that's going to be it for this episode. That's going to be it for today. Thank you all so much for watching. Thank you all so much for your time. And as always, I hope you have a great day. And if you enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing. Thank you all so much for watching. And I hope you have a great day. Repetitive. Forgot that bit. Hope you understand. Thank you so much.